Hey folks, Phil Mackey here, U.S. Cellular Field in Chicago. Twins win 6-2 over the White Sox. And the big story, Joe Maurer making his first Major League start at first base tonight. And he looked phenomenal, looked like a natural out there. Uh, fielded five balls, made 13 putouts, two assists. And uh, the White Sox wasted no time. Omar Vizquel hit a pretty hard low-line drive with Juan Pierre on first base. And Maurer snagged it just to his left. Stepped on the bag for the double play, and instead of the White Sox having runners on second, third, nobody out to start the game, you know, Maurer puts two outs on the board right away. You fast forward to the fifth inning, uh, makes a scoop, not a difficult scoop, but a scoop on Nishioka's play in the hole. Uh, makes kind of a sprawling stab to his right, a backhanded stab on another Vizquel uh, ground ball, and then later in the game makes the diving, kind of a diving, sprawling stop to his right and flips to Matt Caff to end the game. Made a tough scoop on a Danny Valencia backhanded play. He really had all kinds of different uh, types of plays, line drives, ground balls, had to cover first on several throws. And, uh, and after the game, he admitted to being nervous, and he's kind of gave off that hint throughout the last couple of weeks when he's been taking ground balls that he's more nervous uh, about failing. He, it's not that he didn't want to play first base because he didn't want to move from out behind the plate, even though that might sort of play into it. And believe it or not, he was more nervous about letting down his teammates and failing at first base, which is crazy to think about because really on a scale of what Doug Mankiewicz to David Ortiz as far as uh, soft hands are concerned... He falls much closer to the Doug Mankiewicz side. He looked like he's been playing first base forever. This will now give the Twins a chance to catch Maurer three to four times a week or up to five times a week, whatever he can handle. But it also opens the gate for the first time where they can put him at a different position, first base. He felt comfortable with it. He enjoyed himself. He was out there smiling. Uh, the manager after the game, Andrew on Gardenhier, raved about the performance and said, uh, you know, Maurer's going to see this as more of a vacation you know, getting out from behind the plate, playing first base, it's more of a vacation than a hindrance. It'll it'll save your back, it'll save your knees. And so this sort of sets the precedent for the Twins to do this more often. Catch Maurer three to four days a week, DH him a day, and then let him play first base a day. Uh, you'll see it more often. He's willing to do it, although Maurer's adamant that he's still a catcher. Uh, I think it's a good precedent to set this. Don't pull him out from behind the plate entirely, but mix him in. He showed he can handle it, and uh, oh yeah, he went three for five at the plate as well with two RBIs, so maybe the bat's finally coming around. Uh, three games left until the All-Star break. Joe Maurer, first base debut, successful. I'm Phil Mackey. This is U.S. Cellular Field. Keep an eye on 1500ESPN.com for more Twins updates.